one of my biggest pet peeves is hearing a non-Calvinist say, well, we just don't believe in that predestination stuff. Predestination is a biblical word and we believe in it. In fact, that's where our security is. I know that I'm going to heaven because God is predestined for believers to go to heaven. So you have to ask the question, who has been predestined to what? You don't just assume that certain people arbitrarily were picked before the foundation of the world and predestined to become believers, which is the entailment of Calvinism. All believers in Christ have been destined beforehand for glory. The two major uses by Paul are in Ephesians 1 and Romans chapter 8. In Romans 8, it's predestined to become conformed to the image of his son. Well, who's predestined to become conformed to the image of his son? Believers are. Uh, and, and in uh, Ephesians, what are they predestined to? To become holy and blameless. Well, holy and blameless, that's Jesus, right? He's the only holy and blameless one. So it's the same thing. So who is being predestined to what? Believers are being predestined to become holy and blameless like Christ.